All right, Terry and Rapatage V box, the cotton horse, cotton candy horse. All right, let's just open it up first. It's the best place to open it up from. So I think this box has two, uh, four total booster packs in it, and I think two of them are battle styles. I'm not sure what the two other ones are. The older sets, maybe. Let's slide it out. Ooh, it's pretty. Okay, toss it on both sides. Ooh. It's actually my first time opening a jumbo card, so. Actually, feels. More plasticky than the actual cards. Wait, where did the small card go? Oh, still in the plastic here. It's like another protection layer here. I guess here's a cool card for the glare knife dash. Ooh. Libra horn. I guess Rapatash is a Libra then? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let me uh let me take out these packs and uh sleeve these two things. So got two battle styles. And uh, one Darkness Ablaze and one Rebel Clash. This is a Charizard in Darkness Ablaze, right? I'll we'll try seeing if we get that. Let me sleeve these first. I actually bought some big sleeves for the jumbo cards. I was looking online on what, like how to sleeve these, and then I saw some recommendations online. Whoa. These are just bigger sleeves from uh, BW, and then I think um, ooh, it's a bit too big, I'd say. And then Ultra Pro has big top loaders as well. Yeah, I would say that sleeve is a bit too big. Yeah. Doesn't look as cool as I, as well fitted as I would have hoped. Mm. These are the big top loaders. Almost saw my reflection there. Yeah, you did see my reflection. They should fit, right? Just trying to compare it. Wow, yeah. I feel like it's be a tight fit. Maybe this wasn't the greatest combination. Did I get lied to on Reddit? Yeah, it doesn't fit that well. I don't know if I should be wrapping the sleeve or not. Okay. That's a tight fit for the sleeve. Yeah, it's going down. Okay, it's not going down anymore. Oh man, that's not a great. It's not a great. It's not so great. Okay, that's better. It's all in now. It is way bigger than the card though. Hmm. 
Doesn't look super great. All right, let's open these boosters. Let's try from the top. These are definitely easier than last time. Don't jinx it, don't jinx it. Yeah. Let's, see. Let's hope for some alternative arts or some full arts. Kind of hard to get out. Scratch these just a bit more. Spare. All right. Code card. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Darkness energy. Girder. He's holding a girder. Tactern. Level ball. Sat cat. Esper. Flip bug, silly cobra. Is he supposed to be a silly cobra? Houndor, lick a tongue. Oh, reverse rapid strike. That looks pretty cool. And on the back, ooh, it's a V card. Corbinite V. That's pretty good. Right. Do Rebel Clash first and then Battle Slot after. Let's open the Rebel Clash back. Oh, this one's feeling kind of hard. Oh, ah, prevailed. I actually don't know what's good from Rebel Clash. Like, what's a possible good pull? Code card. I assume it's four to the front. Psychic energy. Palo San. This is like Pokemon that viewers kids in, right? Sketchy Pokemon. Training court. Lampent. Caterpie. It's cute looking at the moon. Barboach, Harokuda, Stuffle, Lotan, Barbarical, and at the back we have Zamazenta, but not hollow. Right, let's do another battle styles. Leaf energy. More Peko. A uh, hangry mode. Durant. Kevin Durant. Mustard and ketchup. Frillish. Houndor. Houndor. Scatterbug. Hone Edge. Gligar. Yin Shao. Looks like a Kung Fu master. At the end, we have. Ooh, shiny Luxray. I mean, a uh, hollow Luxray. It's nice. It's pretty good. Both battle styles were hits, but the Rebel Clash wasn't. Hope we get a hit in the Darkness of Blaze. Charizard? Ooh, this one did not open nicely. Alright, cool card. 
other side. Code card. I wonder if it would be four to the front then. Alright. Steel energy, combuskin, fighting fire chickens, Pokemon breeder, Gotharita, Spinarak, Squovet, Greedy, Squovet, Rowlet, Centret, Galarian Darumaka. The other one's fire, right? Mm. Took trio. Right. And at the end. Oh, Arctovish. I guess it's a fossil. On hollow though. It's too bad. Alright. Here's my haul for today. Thanks for watching.